Hi everyone, welcome to the Prime Math Lovers YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve this six degree equation. Uh, x squared plus 3x plus 2 times x squared minus 7x plus 12 times x squared minus 2x minus 1 plus 24 is equal to 0. This question is from Harvard MIT math tournament uh, and they want us to find all okay. six roots. First, we are going to factorize all these factors, all these three factors. So, um, first of all, I, uh, I replace 3x by x plus 2x. I replaced minus 7x by minus 3x minus 4x. And I write down the rest, the rest as the same. Now... Um, we, we can see that b b between these two, uh, I can factor x, so it will be x times x plus 1. I factor 2, it, it will be 2 times x plus 1. Between these two, I factor x again, x times x minus 3. And between these two, I factor minus 4. It will be x mi uh, minus 4 times x minus 3. And write down the rest. Now, uh, we have x plus 1. Uh, here 2x plus 1 and 2x minus 3 here so we can factor x plus 1 between these two and it will be x plus 1 times x plus 2 times x minus 1 times x minus 4 and uh, write down the rest uh, now I uh, swap these two factors it means I uh, want to expand this factor by this one and this factor by this one. So x plus 1 times x minus 3 will be x squared minus x minus 3x plus x minus 3. And here I have we will have x squared minus 4x plus 2x minus 8. And the rest will be the same. Um, now I uh, I make it a little bit simple. I simplify them. It will be x squared minus 2x minus 3 by, times x squared minus 2x minus 8 times x squared minus 2x minus 1. We can see that we have in all these three factors x squared minus 2x. And if I write down, uh, I replace minus, uh, I add a minus 1 to these uh, three factors, it will be x squared minus 2x plus 1 minus 1, and all, and all these three factors will be the same. x squared minus 2x plus 1, x squared minus 2x plus 1. And um, <clears throat> I simplify minus 3 and minus 4, uh, th and minus 1 and minus 3 will be minus 4, minus 3 minus 8 will be minus 9, and minus 1 minus 1 will be minus 2. Um, we know from um, algebra identities that a minus b plus uh, a minus b squared is equal to a squared plus b squared minus 2ab or x minus 1 squared will be is equal to x squared minus 2x plus 1 and we have x squared minus 2x plus 1 on all these three factors so I can replace them with x minus 1 squared and the, our equation will be x minus 1 squared minus 4 times x minus 1 squared minus 9 and times x minus 1 squared minus 2 and plus 24 is equal to 0. I, we need to um, solve this equation now. Okay, um, for solving this, uh, we use a changed variable. We um, create a new variable named u and put u is equal to x minus 1 squared. Uh, and we 
use the and, and we write down the equation in terms of u. So it will be u minus 4 times u minus 9 times u minus 2 plus 24 is equal to 0. Now we our sixth degree equation is a third degree equation or a cubic equation. We expand these two factors by together so it will be u2 minus 9u minus 4u minus 4 times minus 9 will be 36 times u minus 2 is equal to um, plus 24 is equal to 0. Now minus 9u minus 4u will be minus 13u. So we have u squared minus 13u plus 36 times u minus 2 plus 24 is equal to 0. Now we expand these two factors. u2 by u will be u cubed minus um, 2u squared minus 13u u squared minus, uh, plus, sorry, minus 30, 13u uh, times minus 2 will be plus 26u and uh, plus 36u, 36 times minus 2 will be minus 72. And if we simplify this, we will have u, u cubed minus 15u squared plus 62u minus 48. 26u plus 36u will be 62u. Now we need to uh, solve this equation. Um, if we check that we can see that um, with, uh, if we uh, put 1 uh, for u, uh, the equation will be valid. It means that 1 minus 15 plus 62 minus 48. 1 plus 15, 1 minus 15 will be um, negative 14, plus 62 is positive 48. 48 minus 48 is 0. So u is, one, u is equal to 1 is one of our answers. Now I, I try to factorize, but u minus 1. Uh, so uh, in, um, I replace this um, 15u2 by minus u u squared, sorry, m m minus 15 u squared, I replace that it with minus u squared minus 14 squared. And plus 62 u, I replaced it with plus 14 u plus 48 u. Then minus 48 is equal to 0. Now I factor u squared between these two terms, so it will be u squared um, times u minus 1. Between these two, it will be minus, I factor minus 14, it will be minus 14u. Sorry, I uh, factor minus 14u, it will be minus 14u but, uh, times u minus 1. And here I factor 48, it, it will be f, um, plus 48 times u minus 1. Now I can factor u minus 1 on all these three terms. So we will have u minus 1 by u squared minus 14u plus 48 is equal to 0. Uh, now I uh, replace this minus 14u by minus 6u minus 8u. And between these two terms, I factor u. So we will have u minus 1 times u times u minus 6. And between these two, I factor minus 8. It will be minus 8 times u minus 6. Uh, I need another parenthesis here. Uh, now I can factor, factor u minus 6. So at the end we will have u minus 1 times u minus 6 times u minus 8 is equal to 0. I, and we know that solving this uh, equation is very simple. Uh, we have three factors is equal to zero, so it means that we need to um, uh, put each factor is equal to zero. For doing this, we um, first we uh, case one is u minus one is equal to zero. U minus one is equal to zero. It means that u is equal to one, and we know that u is um, equal to x minus one squared. Then uh, we, it means that x minus 1 squared is equal to 1. We uh, square root from, uh, both sides of the equation, so x minus 1 is equal to plus minus 1. 
and um, with uh, um, <clears throat> If uh, x minus 1 is equal to minus 1, means is x1 is equal to 0, and x minus 1 is equal to plus 1, we take minus 1 to the other side, it will be x2 is equal to 2. Two of the roots are 0 and 2. Case 2, u minus 6. u minus 6 is equal to 0, means u is equal to 6. u is equal to 6 means x minus 1 squared is equal to 6. <clears throat> x minus 1 squared is equal to 6. We can square root of both sides. So we will have um, x minus 1 is equal to plus or minus radical 6 and uh, square root of 6. Then uh, if we take minus 1 to the other side of the equation, x3 and x4 is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of 6. Uh, the third term is u minus 8. We put u minus 8 is equal to 0. Then we have u is equal to 8. And means x minus 1 squared equal to 8. x minus 1 squared is equal to 8. We square root both sides. So we will have x minus 1 is equal to plus or minus square root of 8. And um, <clears throat> we know that the square root of 8 is 2 square root of 2. We can um, put 8 as 4 times 2 and bring 4s outside the radical. So uh, x3 and x4 will be 1 plus or minus 2 radical 2. As simple as that. I hope you like, uh, you enjoy this video. Uh, it will be much appreciated if you like the video, subscribe our channel, and uh, tell your friends about our channel. Thank you so much.